Hi, my name is Jason. Let's connect the dots. In this video, I want to show you how to find the twist rate of your rifle. But before we get into that, who cares? Why do we need to find the twist rate? Have you ever been trying to tune a rifle and you simply cannot get a particular bullet to work? There are many pieces to this puzzle, but a foundational piece is matching the bullet up with the twist rate. When a bullet's traveling down the bore, it starts to spin. Different diameters, lengths, and weights of bullets need to spin at different rates in order to stabilize. This stabilization is needed for accuracy and precision. The spin is controlled by the twist rate of the barrel. Here's an analogy that will work. It's like throwing a football. In order to have a tight spiral, the quarterback needs to spin the ball at the correct rate. If the quarterback does not spin it correctly, the ball will wobble. In the bullet world, wobble is called yaw, and yaw is a precision killer. If you want to have the highest level precision possible, you need to match the bullet up with the twist rate. This is a 26 caliber barrel. So I am going to use a 22 caliber nylon brush and I'm gonna wrap a cotton patch around that nylon brush. I'm going to insert that nylon brush into the barrel I'm going to take a silver sharpie and I'm going to mark the cleaning rod at the chamber. I'm also going to mark the cleaning rod back here at the handle. And I'm slowly going to insert the cleaning rod and this mark back here is going to make one complete revolution. So I'm just simply waiting for that mark to get back to the same spot. Now I'm going to mark the cleaning rod again at the chamber. Withdraw the cleaning rod. And I take a tape measure and I measure the distance between my two marks on the cleaning rod. And this is eight and a half inches, which means the cleaning rod made one revolution in eight and a half inches. Therefore, I have a one and eight and a half twist barrel. All right, so we know why we need to find the twist rate. We know how to find the twist rate, but how do we match the bullet up with the twist rate? There are two main scenarios that you will face. If you are building a rifle, you almost always pick the bullet you want to shoot first, then buy the proper twist barrel. If you're buying a rifle, you'll have to find the twist rate of your barrel, then match up the proper bullet. Either way, the good news is many bullet manufacturers are listing the needed twist rate to stabilize their bullets. If you have any questions or any doubts, give them a call. Matching the bullet up with the twist rate is a foundational piece of the accuracy puzzle. Until next time, enjoy the experience.